Do you know the Zenith DeFi skyline? Let's talk about it. Welcome back everyone to another episode and today with summer right here, hotness and everything, I figured why not do a video on a watch that perfectly fits into the category of being a steel sports watch and something that you might not have on your radar just yet. It's hot, summer is here in full swing. You might still be looking for a watch that you'd like to wear on your wrist when going on vacation or just enjoying it during summer, wherever you are. So I have one watch here that I didn't have on my radar and I was pretty surprised on how good it actually feels and looks. And this is a watch from a very, very well-known brand called Zenith. And the watch I have here with me is the Zenith DeFi Skyline. And this is a watch that was just released at Watches and Wonders this year and I did have the opportunity to check out the watch during the fair but I did not really have the time to actually get a real feeling of it. And so with all my reviews I really want to get a feeling for the watch. I want to see how they actually fit on the wrist, how they feel and how they match my style and how I like wearing them. I was pleasantly surprised by this watch. But before we go into deep with this particular watch I'd like to get the specs out of the way because I know you guys like them. Again, as always, you will have a link to the watch in the description down below. This watch has an octagonal case. It is a steel sports watch, so it has a steel case, obviously. It has an open case back and you can look into this very nice movement actually. And the watch uses the in-house caliber 3620, which is a high frequency caliber, meaning that I have no idea what it actually does. Thank you, Google. Meaning that this high frequency movement is more durable and more, well, can withstand more external impacts and everything. Sunshine in the back. This is why you need a steel sports watch because you sweat a lot during summer. We've covered the basic specs. Um, what I still wanna say, this watch is also 100 meter water resistant. That's a plus point if you need to take this watch for a swim. And the movement has 60 hours of power reserve. You can put it down for a couple of days, pick it back up and it will still be running. The watch also has a date. And for me, this is very important. The date disc matches the color on the dial. So the date is not visible at first sight. Only if you need to look at it, you can. And this is what I really appreciate Zenith doing for this watch because I don't know. I just don't understand why you would want to have a white date disc on, on a watch. Then there's something special about this watch. It has a one tenth of a second indicator, which means that every 10 seconds the hand moves once around the disc. Basically, this doesn't tell you anything about basic seconds, but it's actually pretty fun to look at. The overall look of the watch is very clean, very subtle. It has a very nice blue dial with, I'd say, some stars shaped inside of the dial. It looks great, in my opinion. It's a very clean look, very minimalistic look. And this is something that I really, really appreciate brands doing incorporating this type of look this minimalist sporty vibe making for a very comfortable watch and I think this is also something moving toward to more and more is that watches have become more of an art piece rather than actually tool in terms of telling you the time. And therefore I think that the designers have a lot of potential in trying out different things. And this is something that I really appreciate about this watch. Now that we're in the whole topic of style, why do I actually like this watch? And why do I think that you should have it on your radar? First of all, the watch comes with a metal bracelet and a caltrux strap. It has a super fast, very intuitive, quick release mechanism. Press the button on the, on the bottom, you take it out, very easy, you put it back in, done. So this is something that I really appreciate. I like this and you know me, I'm a strap guy, so it comes in handy from time to time. As you know, I sometimes have a bit of troubles finding the right watch, um, finding the right size for me, but this is a great watch to have on the wrist. It wears very comfortable. This is something that I really appreciate. I don't want my watches to be too thick or too thin 
or too big or too small, they have to have good proportion. And I think that with the DeFi Skyline, Zenith did a great job in making a watch that also fit smaller wrists, but also bigger wrists and therefore Good job. I think that this is a great watch to wear during summer. I know I say this a lot, but I really think about these things. I think about how you would wear the watch and how I would wear the watch. And then I try the watch and I try to wear it on how I think I would like to wear it. I think it's very important nowadays to incorporate your personal style. And with that, we as men, well, usually only have so much of accessories to use. And one of these accessories are watches. I think for me at least a watch is the most important accessory that I use and it has to fit my personal style. And with steel sports watches I sometimes feel either they're too much luxury or too little sport so therefore it doesn't really mix and match and it's not something that I wear to the beach when it doesn't even have 100 meters of water resistance. I mean it doesn't make any sense. This is something that I really think about and that's why I wanted to make this point. The other thing is in terms of sports watches is the actual fit on the wrist. It has to be comfortable. The watch shouldn't be too thick. It shouldn't be too thin. Obviously it should have at least 100 meters of water resistance. This is something that I look for the most and I think Zenith did a great job in creating a watch that really fits nicely for me at least. Therefore if you think that this is a cool watch as well definitely give it a try. Go to your local Zenith dealer. Check it out. If you're looking for a steel sports watch for a luxury steel sports watch and obviously with all the things that are going on with other brands there are some brands that are still very accessible as the DeFi Skyline is. Yes you might need to wait a little bit sometimes they've, they've told me actually that the watch is in high demand but you don't have to wait too long so maybe only a couple of weeks and the price is also very great with 8,300 euros you get a watch from a very respected very talented watchmaker with a lot of quality in their movements. You have a watch that you can really rely on. The look of the watch, the design is great as well. I think it's very sleek. The skyline is a bit more minimalistic, so you don't have too much going on on the dial, which is great as well. Overall, I think this is a great watch. I was really positively surprised on how good it actually felt on the wrist. I didn't have any expectations when trying it out, and therefore, this is a watch that I definitely consider wearing during summer, for example, on the lake, going for a swim, taking the boat out. It would go nicely with a lot of my swim swim shorts. So therefore, that being said, this is it for the video. So thank you very much for watching. Please do subscribe. It would be very nice of you. And as always, if you feel like it, put a thumbs up. I hope you enjoy your summer. I will definitely do so and see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.